Ain't No Mountain High Enough, a wonderful tune, a great hit by Marvin Gaye, also sung as a duet with Tammy Terrell originally. And uh, the bass player in this one was the great James Jamerson. So we're really, um, we really have a great opportunity to work with his bass line. So um, a few things for us to bear in mind. Number one, we'll play the whole thing in second position. And there are, of course, you could do it in different positions. I see some guys start up in fifth. We could shift down into first, but let's stay in second position. That's how I like to do it. And um, I think it makes the most sense also. So for example, right at the beginning, we're gonna start with that A, and then we're going to pivot or extend down to the G sharp. So I'm not moving my thumb. Also, the whole way through, you wanna play with a really nice legato. James Jamerson did that, and that's really a mark of what the pros are able to do to play with a legato. Legato means that we will connect each note, smoothly connecting each note. So, for example, in major three, we want it to sound like this. Nice and smooth, not staccato like that, not short like that. Also, you want to look at that chorus, or spend some, some serious time on the chorus. That's the trickiest part. You'll find the first four lines are going to come along pretty well. But then the chorus, those last two lines of the first page, some tricky stuff, a number of tricky techniques in there. Um, we're going to be doing a lot of pivoting throughout the chorus down to the first fret and sliding up with the first finger. Also, we're going to do some muting of the G string. so that we don't hear both strings like this. Hear both of those strings, we don't want that. Um, another thing we have going on is that we're gonna be doing some, uh, yeah, oh yeah, a, a good bit of raking towards the end, especially the last two bars of the chorus. A lot of raking, so E, B, E, B, and then G, D, G, D, raking. E, D, E, D. All right. Well, let's get started. Let's move on to the next video and start in with the first verse.